So, this video, I'm going to do a insect collection video. Um, I don't, well, I don't know if I'm gonna make multiple parts, but let's just see. Let's start with this box right here. Actually, no. Start with the mantises, Dictyoptera. Got European mantis. Two fe four, three females, three males, and then uh, two female California mantises. Got both colors of both of them. This one I got as a nymph. The nymph was actually green, and then as it molted, it was brown, which is really cool. So now I have both the green one and the brown one. Um, this is a orchid mantis I got from Big Bugs. Um, they are great, great people. Um, these two I got from a a. Uh, I just sit down here. These two. Hissing cockroaches, a little baby nymph, and then an adult. Maybe it's a male. I don't know. Maybe a female. The male's horns are usually bigger than that. I don't know. This took like three days to die. This is a German roach. I found dead in a bird, bird supply store. And then some oriental roaches. And yeah, that's my... Um, that is my praying mantises. And roaches. And also, I realize... Um, Dictyoptera also includes termites. Which I never knew. Um, let's go with the moths. Um... Io moth. Got this from Big Bugs. I don't know what these are. Some of you guys may tell me. False underwing and then large underwing. This one I found a chrysalis and then it hatched. Um, white speck. Another white speck. I don't know what these are. Um... Alfalfa looper, um, broom moth, um, some geometrid moths. Now this some kind of looper. I don't know what this is. Well, it looks really cool. Reminds me of the cicada. Um, here's a plume moths. I love those. Well, the the pink is really good on the camera. These are both um, Volupo moths. And that's it for my moths. Now, can we start? Okay, let's start here. Alright. This is a, a lined short crab. This is a um, red swamp crayfish. The biggest one I ever caught. It's huge. Crazy. The claws are two inches long. Crazy big. This turned out really well. What I did is I took the carapace off and then... The crayfish, I ripped the tail off, you know, like, twist it and then pull it. Scraped all the meat out, and then took salt, and then sprinkled it in the all the little cavities there. And then it'll just dry, and then over, like, a month, it'll stop stinking. And now you got cool little specimens. Um, a woodlouse right here. And then a pill bug. 
two pill bugs right here. Millipede, centipede, um, shrimp tail. I have fucking no idea why I pinned that, but it's just there. Um, yeah, I was just bored, I guess. Um, Uh, some kind of Phidippus. Um, its whole back end is red. I know it's some kind of Phidippus. Bright blue, uh, Chalicerae. I don't know if you can see it right. Down there, the Chalicerae are bright iridescent green. That's really common in jumping spiders. Um, these ones are creepy. The woodlouse spiders. Got a little red face jumper here. I'm sorry. The pointing in the camera where it is, it's really hard to show. Dang it. Red face jumper. Some other kind of jumper. Um, got a tick. I, it wasn't biting me, it, it, this is a, I believe it's a deer tick. Yeah, it's really pretty, P ticks are actually pretty cool little bugs. They're not really bugs, they're mites. Um, big emperor scorpion. Um, I would rather get pinched by this than this, because these are much stronger. I've been... This is a little bark scorpion. Very large bark scorpion. Got in Shasta. Shasta Lake. And Lakehead. Um, I have a cabin up there. We stay at. And then last but not least, the tarantula. Goliath bird eater. Very small Goliath bird eater. Like, the ones in this area in California are bigger than this. Or as big as that. But this is not a full grown one. I don't know why they didn't get me. Thick bugs explain. Um. I think they have a YouTube. I don't know. No, I don't think so. I don't think they have a YouTube. Anyway, yeah. Got a little baby bird eater. Um, let's move on to my spasma today. Stick bugs. Got a jungle nymph and then walking leaf. These are so weird. They feel... Exactly like leaves. Like, not so much this one, like fish hooks on its legs. Though, I was trying to pin that and it got me a couple times. Um, here's a walking leaf. Feels just like a leaf. If you were blindfolded, you wouldn't know what the hell that was. So, that's cool. Um, moving on to the Neoroptera, um, snake fly, stone fly, um, spoon wing, this I got from Big Bugs, very cool, um, Black caddis flies, um, yellow mayfly, and then like a barred winged mayfly. I don't know the names. Um, this is probably, I don't know the names of these two, but this is probably like a greater ant lion and then this is like a lesser ant lion both of these this one i got at an, at nevada this is at walmart 
on the pillar, big pillar on the building, you know, to keep the, you know, when you walk in, there's a door and then there's a big overhang pillars. It was on this side, this big guy. And then there's, there's a lot of these, um, spoon wing, this is cool. And yeah, that's it. This is part one. Part two will be tomorrow. So. Yeah. Goodbye.